Saint Bernard of uh, Clairvaux was uh, quite the uh, priest. You know, you hear uh, titles given to people, uh, man of the century, a woman of the century, and it seems that uh, such titles are applied to everything now. They have, uh, you know, golfer of the century, uh, right tackle of the century, uh, composer, and so on. And it seems that, uh, you know, the line is no longer has much punch, but the, uh, the man of the 12th century, without a doubt, is uh, St. Bernard. Um, in the year 1111, at the age of 20, uh, he left his home to join the uh, Cistercians in the uh, Chateau. His uh, five brothers, his two uncles, and uh, 30 of his friends followed him into the monastery. And within four years, a dying uh, community had uh, recovered enough vitality to establish a new house in the nearby valley of uh, Wormwoods um, and with, uh, with Bernard as their abbot. And his holy example attracted so many novices that other monasteries had to be built. Um, his zeal for asceticism uh, led him at first to expect uh, too much of his monks who, who were disheartened by his severity but a, a slight breakdown of his health taught him to be more patient and understanding. And so he was able to uh, lead his fellow religious forward to uh, great perfection by the, the sweetness of his correction and the mildness of his uh, paternal leadership. Uh, his life was characterized by a very deep devotion to the Blessed Mother uh, he's credited with uh, composing the prayer, the Memorari, uh, which many of you know, I'm sure. And uh, his sermons and books about Mary are still the standard of uh, Mariology, which is uh, Marian theology. Um, he would encourage devotion to Our Lady in the words uh, he, he once wrote, uh, in dangers and doubts and difficulties, think of Mary. Call upon Mary. Let not her name depart from your lips. Never suffer it to leave your heart. And that you may be more sure that you may more surely obtain the assistance of her prayers. Neglect not to walk in her footsteps. With her for guide. You shall never go astray. While invoking her, you shall never lose heart. So long as she is in your mind, you are safe from deception. While she holds your hand, you cannot fall. Under her protection, you have nothing to fear. If she walks before you, you shall not grow weary. If she shows you favor, you shall reach your goal. His uh, writings have earned for him the, the title of the, the last uh, father of Holy Mother Church and, uh, and one of its most famous doctors. He died on August 20th, 1153, so we would do well to heed his advice, stay close to Our Lady, and uh, we will reach our goal, as he says.